We're the Cyclones. And you're watching It's Just Music with Sicko ENT on the Signature Series Network. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to have nightmares after this interview. <laughs> Take a picture. <laughs> 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 Hey, Chris Ballou from the Presidents of the United States of America. Yo, what's happening, y'all? This is Rich Ball. Both of us are for the army. Yo, what up? It's Terry Robbins from the Strange Music. I'm Bad Bad Ponda. Yo, what up, Kim Folk? This is your boy Smoke. Woo, woo, right here in the face. Yo, what's up? It's just music. What's up? What up, world? It's your boy True Willie the Billy, man. Y'all already know what's going on. There's a whole lot of dang shit going on on my side. You feel me? Yo, this is Gunk here with Lyrical Snuff Productions out of Denver, Colorado. Yo, what's happening? This Pope from Project Born, and it's just music, and you rockin' with Sicko ENT. What up? It's Cody Madison, rapper LSU, Park Life, and you're Man, this is A.O. Dre, and you are watching Just Music. I'm Jason Dunn from Double Dare Entertainment, and you're watching It's Just Music. It's your boy Cognito. You're watching It's Just Music. Uh, LB, Sickening Sicko Entertainment. What's up? This is Frank Nitty from Project Born, and it's Just Music. Your boy Chuckles, the head hunter, Cloud Care. Yeah, what up, Chuckles, my boy? LB, Sickening. And it's Just Music. All right, sickos, Zuka here. Time to cut the bullshit. It's time for It's Just Music with LB Sickney. Now, I know something technical is going to go wrong during this video. Just about every episode has a fuck up. And if you can catch it, write it down in the comments. Enjoy the show. Woo -woo. Woo -woo. With your phony little diss track No, I really take that back Homie miss me with that chit chat Always try to call my phone Think he's sweet for me Wonder if he fantasize Laying in his bed at night Depressed in his mind full of regret He hate me, yeah, he upset Need to learn to forgive Joe Block Cause the hate in your heart Gonna make your heart stop I can really give a good goddamn about the past I forgive and move on Got my eyes on the cash And you're still living in the past Still living in the past Still living in the past I can really give a good goddamn about the past I forgive and move on Got my eye on the cash You're still living in the past Still living in the past You're still living in the past So What's up, dude? What's up? You haven't been on the show in a while. No, I haven't. About time you invite me back. <laughs> so today we're going to go over a pretty cool group, man. This is... Uh, fucking Psycho Circus. My homie from G9 Productions and shit. This is his group with uh, Legion the God. I got a track with Legion the God. I got a track with uh, Candy the Clown. Candy's no longer a part of this group anymore, though. So they don't really have an album out yet, right? But they've done live shows and stuff with their music. They've actually performed at the gathering. Uh, how they performed at the gathering without having an album, I don't know. But they did. Uh, this this is... Uh, maybe they're a suck-up. <laughs> maybe. Who knows, man. <laughs> so check, check this out. This is a 15-minute performance. This is the first time they all performed together. Before we get into that, yo, make sure you go check out the new uh, Ninth Wonder magazine. You know what I'm saying? January edition 2023, these guys are in three years. I'm in this book twice. I got two for... Uh... And they spelled his name wrong. Yes, they did. The, well, the idea of it is it's flawed. The, the name of the song is flawed. Right? It's flawed. So, there's a flaw in it. Whatever. It's art. Let's go, man. Let's check this out. In my skull, sounds are fading and color is dull. Woke up in a pitch black train at the last station. 
turn to speak The conductor made a shocking statement I pulled it out of my seat by fell My heart is racing So thought I can't even see myself Here demons chasing Me through the flames And I'm feeling the pains That I thought went away But I gave myself a facelift How did I make this? I'm brainless Great message from beyond the grave So take this In my life, let me be lifeless Waking up every day, praying to die, crying, stressed Don't wanna go to hell, but I wanna end it all Yes, this time I cut my heart out with a knife to my chest I was damn it, that's my second attempt at death Cause I woke up not in hell, but still depressed I guess I'm blessed Till I woke up and saw the flames destroying my flesh While the pains I'm feeling, spill on my head This time you did I jerked from where I heard from the devil, I turned it fled Smacked it to the walls, the room turned crimson red Realizing my doom from the hole in my chest, I bled Wishing I'd reconsider before my soul left what I meant once again, jolt to the wake, two deaths that are fake I don't know how much more of this I could take Am I alive or dead? Am I going insane? What about heaven and hell? They exist, don't they? Confused with my axe in my hand, I started to pray Heard nothing, but I guess I was too impatient to wait Then on my back, I took my hatchet to my stomach Away, tears in my eyes, God, why I'm not laughing today I don't wanna wake, I feel fatigued As I slowly faint, open my eyes again to see the heavenly gates Depart from me I start to fall and realize my fate Reaching for the letters, I fall into the night all great Endless vicious circling, I fall for days Unimaginable, forever cast from grace I'll be causing my doubts, now it's too late Then I'll wake with the gun in my hand Man, maybe I'll wait Got him yelling, ooh, I'ma show you what to do And how to move, and how to keep the people cool You better check it, little nigga I'm Gotti on this beach, now watch me flash it, little nigga Got him yelling, ooh, I'ma show you what to do And how to move, and how to keep the people cool You better check it, little nigga I'm Gotti on this beach, now watch me flash it, little nigga Step on stage, now they watching Captivated through a gaze, now I got it Ready to rip it, know the name, bring the light They say I'm wicked and this stage is a part of me I'm part of me Anyone thinking they wasn't a part of me Damn, my flow's retarded and in all of my shows I started Honestly None of you niggas ever bother me These rappers selling hip-hop I created my own genre, see? You only speaking what you think You know I faint These hoes Leaving on my dainty clothes You see my painted face Try to compare my soul Just know my son's the only one To ever air my throne Bitch This for my y'all music maniacs This buying tickets to kick it And giving hella death just getting started and we talk across the globe Fucking up the party, getting naughty Name another better live show Ooh, I'ma show you what to do And how to move And how to keep the people cool You better check it, little nigga I'm Gotti on your speech Now watch me bless your little nigga I got him yelling Ooh, I'ma show you what to do And how to move And how to keep Give me the trouble and let me freak the bass They say I got a double time to suit the people's taste If I spit a track like Mozzie, then the fans relate I tend to scare some people, probably shouldn't paint my face Man, fuck that My people love it when I pop my shit I been getting busy on the beat, I get the bus and quit Say he hella got it, yet they hardly wanna listen to He be too aggressive with his message Yes, they hate me cause I'm confident This scared crow been growing green cold I put it all out on the line to save a couple souls Yeah Collective visions bring a bigger picture Dishing division from these niggas And I'm holding them account I 
I see a lot of you resort to rap resort Completely to rap. skip over the purpose just to get it right back nigga, what was that? Then you take what's meant for good and give the people trash that's Common sense trash. ain't common For the comments, I'ma get it back And that's a fact You heard your sound? I think it's coming up from the ground Just look around us, surrounded by clowns And we running down and we up in your town Look at things, smile right upside down But slight your breast off bounds right now But you leave a new gash in your right eyebrow Sleeping on me like I'm a so down somehow You a slow Pokemon on a track like NASCAR Mind stay sharp with a glass shard Weed in a glass jar Brain out of space right past Mars Putting on that to get a black card Bust you quick, you're a dick and you're not hard But just bit fast cause you're somewhere than a retard Axe to a knife fight, bust like unguard We all know you couldn't stop it down in a junkyard I am a beast, nobody illa Four foot ten but I feel like Godzilla Down with the beat, bitch I'm a killer I don't go ape, shit bitch I'm gorilla Ready for the killing in your dream So got the game locked up I maximize on my demands and make investments quick. I'm just trying to build my Barbie house and live in it.
Sophisticated psycho Ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals I'm reaping souls and reading bibles Sophisticated psycho Ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals Reaping souls and reading Bibles, sophisticated psycho. They saying I'm crazy and talking out my neck. Like I'm stupid, the dots just don't connect. Say I'm foolish and I ain't at my best. Tell our Rubik's Cube him and school him like how I dice the flesh. I'm disgusted by this race. A human generation based on jealousy and hate. The time it takes for healing and to put things in its place is a fucking waste of energy. I'd rather see your fate. You got more potential than this I strive to teach the people better through the ignorance and bliss And I've been holding my composure through this shit But what I really want to do is sever off your limbs Sophisticated psycho Ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals I'm reaping souls and reading bibles Sophisticated psycho Ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals I'm reaping souls and reading bibles Sophisticated psycho Everybody wanna be a record breaker But can't nobody see his cause to separate you They claim they didn't mean it when they go and demonstrate The very thing they deeply hurt your soul and still expect impatience Damn, I think they caught me salivating I've been hella patient, no control, I'm feeling elevated I'm a magnet patient, schizo fuck, the trunk and hatchet's waiting Trying to make a painting, join the circus, get emancipated Raising L and take I've been skits my whole damn life, fucking right Lost control, gave it a whole damn pipe We'll be fighting in the morning, cause she'll think I'm hella weird Whispering nothing's in the baby tone, gnawing on the air Sophisticated psycho, ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals I'm reaping souls and reading bibles Sophisticated psycho Ain't no telling the places I go Searching the dark to bring you light though But you know just like I know That I'll be clowning on my rivals I'm reaping souls and reading bibles Sophisticated psycho Dollars A couple dollars make them holler, bitch Dollars You know what I'm saying? And for that to be their first performance, man, I really liked. I really liked the. Uh, how they made it like a show, you know what I mean? You can see them all dancing in the back while one person took their turn. It was different acts. I like it. I like, I like their the look of them. I like their their logo. I don't know. I think it's dope. I think Legion is the most talented one, though. Which one was Legion? The the black guy okay. with the face paint. They all had face paint. Right. <laughs> Which one do you like the most? The one that was sitting in the chair at the beginning. Really? Yeah. He's talented. Uh, I'm probably going to show the song I have with him back in the day as the last track. It's a song called Hornography. Anyways, let's get into some of this interview, yo. What up, y'all? This is LB Sydney, and you're watching Signature Series Network, the home of my new show. It's just music. Make sure you check me out. The Wolf. Yeah, I got five kids in a house, an ex-wife that won't shut her mouth. 
three babies I don't get to see I got child support and they're bothering me I got bills stacking high to the ceiling Got a hoopty for a ride, this is how I feel And I'm stuck in this town, got nowhere to go I really wanna get out, I got new headphones These headphones, they take me to a place so far away And I travel every day, don't wanna come back Unless that music stays These headphones, they calm my nerves When I feel like dirt or when I let somebody get hurt Or when I wanna hurt myself When I'm just having one of them days These, these, these headphones They take me to a place so far Hi guys Back again with Rat Patch and another great use. We have a joint here that was rolled with a filter, but the filter keeps sliding out. Well, not anymore. You take your Rat Patch and we're using our white papers. You lick the adhesive side. You roll it around, smoothing it as you go. It does not have to be perfect. Boom, bam, finished, look. Tugging is not going anywhere. Twisting, not going anywhere. Now you can enjoy your smoke with the input filter. Ratpatch.com. I've been sleeping all day. I don't feel good at all. Fuck it though. It's about to be a dope interview. What up, y'all? I'm LB Signing. Welcome to It's Just Music. Introduce yourself for the people that don't know who you are. Yeah. I am 1539. I'm just a little bit. We are the cyclos. <laughs> 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 we're on the spot. It's all good. Yeah. It almost worked. It almost worked. Y'all look fresh as fuck, man. Gifted. You and I, uh, we go back quite a ways, man. Let's yeah. let, let's uh, talk about let's talk about a little bit about the past, man. So you you asked me to get on a song a long time ago. What the hell was the name of that shit? It's called Forty Nine with It's gonna be on the which got pushed back by six years because of my second divorce when I left California to come back to the East Coast. And I think story. Well, damn. Yeah, but it's coming. And I don't let any music go away. So it's definitely going to be a wasted uh, feature. It's a, it's a very dope song. It's for a specific crowd, but that's why it's hashtag no filter. Right. <laughs> so I've had two of you guys on the show. Uh, it's It's good to... Well, Gifted, did I ever get you on the show? I think I've had you on the show, right? No? I my ex on the show, who is also was the original member of, uh, she she was the, the fourth you know, member of the original group. Right. I was one of the things happened. She decided it was best for her to go her separate way. And no love lost. That's fine. That, that was the professional way to go about it, I feel. So, you know, that is what it is. That's why there's only a couple songs over here with one of us. There'll be, there'll be singles. And then we decided uh, as a group that we're going to keep going with the three of us at Cycle Lows and, and work on the project and all that stuff in the future. But that, that's the hold up. From the time of gathering to now, a lot of things transpired and a lot of things changed and we had to reconvene and we collect ourselves and basically regroup, literally. And then we agreed as a whole, like, all right, so let's keep doing this thing. Let's keep doing it tonight. Yeah. What made you guys decide to group up in the first place? Uh, well, well, yeah, it just, you know, um, we did the, we actually took the trip to North Carolina and did the hip hop circus yeah. with, with Benzina. Mm -hmm. And that was the first time that the, the Psychologues ever showed, um, you know, we, we just kind of just got together like G39 production, the cycle, you know what I'm saying? The cycle circus, the group, mm -hmm. um, then we just kind of, you know, like meshed. And it, and it worked. <laughs> you know, like, it really worked. You know what I mean? Rap and Grandpa was there, too. I think you had him on as well. Yeah, uh, me and Grandpa's done some work. I did a cartoon for him, too. Yeah. Shout out to RGP, man. <laughs>
was pulled. I lied about my age to work and put food on the table. Cause dad was locked up and my mom was unstable. I state them facts. This ain't no fable. You ain't never had. No, you ain't never had. You think you have what, but you ain't never had. You ain't never had to take 16 Jeeps and turn it into 28 and green. I did that shit with Lee. When you think you see the light at the end of the tunnel, everybody knows it just began. Yes, that struggle. See, I did my best. Found my car repossessed. Lived that life in the past. But I did my best. And you know the rest. If you don't believe my story, you can kiss my. Cause you ain't never had. No, you ain't never had. You think you might have war, but you ain't never had. No, you ain't never had. And you ain't never had. And you, and you, and you, and you ain't never had. And you ain't never had. Uh, so I see the hatchman. Obviously, we see the hatchman. So hatchet men, hatchet ninjas. These are my design. This is me because I disagree with ADB. I'm not struggling with the same time because the other one wants to get that and that's so I'm say about that. You know what I mean? I mean, I get it, right? Uh, <laughs> so name some other artists that inspired you guys to create. For me, being the old school ball, being down so long, of course, I said, you know, ABK, thanks for being home, you know, all the friends. Shout out to the day, home. Um, I got it's open. Big Google. Big Google. Yeah, I like We're here the babies, man. That's what's up. Yeah. So the face paint don't scare them? No, they love it. They actually got their own little drink. <laughs> That's what's up. Even my, even my, my baby girl. Put it down so they can watch it. We'll just pause till he gets back, bro. All right, All right so we good. We good, right? Yeah. What's you guys' creative process like? Okay. It's very unreal. We have to be sick together. This is a traveling motherfucker. Let me tell you, this motherfucker right here loves to travel. Yeah. He, he, he will, like, we be trying to figure out how to get to him. And he be like, no, I'm already on my way. <laughs> I'll be there in an hour and a half. I'm like, oh. All right, so I'll, I'll fire up the doll, <laughs> and we'll get ready. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man. But you know, and, and all of us bring something to it. We all have um, input when it comes to writing concepts, um, stage choreography, uh, clothing. You know what I'm saying? Shout out uh, G39. You know what I'm saying for the for the fits because he got his right. You know what I'm saying? Made sure we had the jerseys and all. I designed these customs. I make jerseys just so people know. Yeah, it's it's, it's, it's all it's definitely all it's inclusive. Other than ICP and Tech Nine, who would you guys like to collaborate with? And don't say me either. <laughs> me either. <laughs> me either. <laughs> um, ABK because I'm a native native lineage. Um, South Carolina nation, South Um, it, it wouldn't matter to me if it was if it came out that he was still doing that for his image. I wouldn't care because of the fact that he's bringing. Um, he's bringing. I need you to go do that. I like Coco Vampire. I, like I actually talked to him here and there. And Buckshot's pretty cool. He's like, they're, very, they're both very personal people. And um, because I have my alter ego as a cowboy joker, definitely one guy. <laughs> are the people that you named uh, Buckshot and Kung Fu Vampire uh, are the most likely more than likely to work with you guys. You know what I'm saying? They they seem to work with a lot of underground artists. In I fact, if you go to, to work with us. If, if you go to Spotify and you look up Kung Fu Vampire, man, there's a whole playlist full of features he's done. Yeah, I'm aware. I, like I said, I talked to him. Um, quite frequently. I mean, the level I'm at and the level he's at, not trying to put myself lower than, you know what I'm saying, just being realistic about it. He's actually really personal. He's not taking right. things from nothing. He's cool with hell. Where are you messing with your life? How long you gonna waste your time? Look inside your mind. You'll find 
check. Yo, hey yo, messing with this life of yours. I am so, so, so far from perfect, and I won't even pretend that I won't have to take a lie before my time here ends. My paranoia, paranoia got me riding and tripping. Too many ends, but they can't hear me, so I just keep on sipping. No scene is greater than the other, yeah, that's what they have told me. I just want to become better than my past, yeah, the old me. When I let the dogs loose, all the killers get a rush. Just the sight of see you blood makes the killer do a blair says. Richard, totally insane. the door off the hinges. Luda Pierce, now the Vikings Brown. Bank Joe, Big Punch, I grew with an insane clown. Kumo, DPD, D, Craig, Mac, and Nottis. Into Shan, EPMD, and a super shot to Ben Bada. Running Z and the Fat Boys. Gunning flow with that crush boo. Bone thugs on the front of the mud game, but something about the rock rocks do. DMX and E40. RIP to my homie Bree. And everybody who contributes to hip hop. Peace out, bro. BJB. Hey, what's up? This is Mike Shepard, the author of the new Project Born Books, dropping July 7th. Uh, get out and check that shit out. Um, and we're rocking with It's Just Music. Sick OENT, man, my homie. Peace. Yo, what's happening? This Pope from Project Born, and it's just music, and you rock it with Sick OENT. Holla at you. What's up? This is Frank Nitty from Project Born, and it's just music. We rock it with Sick OENT, Project Born style, full life. Hey, yay. Woo woo. Thank y'all, man. I appreciate you, man. So I'm going to show a little bit of live footage real quick of them. Let's check that out real quick. That's pretty dope, right? Let's get into some of this interview. Yeah. Blaze, Hunter, Ninth, Wonder. Kobe. I get results, Mr. Get the Job Done by lunchtime. Yeah. Blaze, Hunter, might as well be Mr. Crush Time. Hotter than the sunshine on my prom sweat with how I keep these babies thirsty with my punchlines. I'm that dude making plays, trick you know I'm fine. Against the Bulls, D Wade, triple overtime. Yeah. I'm off the chain like a broken charm. Keep it 100 like LeBron in the open car. Hashtag, get the job done. When it come to crunch time, I'm awesome. Three seconds on the clock, you can call me. And my hands is where the ball be. I'm, I'm, I'm clutch, 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 yeah, baby, I'm clutch, 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 yeah, baby, I'm clutch, 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 yeah, baby, I'm clutch, 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 yeah, baby, I'm clutch. What's your guys' message for your fans? You know, keep it psycho. You know, keep it psycho. Like, just be who the hell you are, the way you want to be. And, and you know, everybody everybody always has an opinion. Don't judge it. Don't judge it. You know, you're too. Every, but, but, but when it comes down to it, when it comes down to the way I see it personally, is when it comes to, like, the judging pattern, because we all do it. Like, even even when we say, oh, don't judge, we still do it. You know what I'm saying? So, like, when it comes down to it, it really, really doesn't matter if you're judging or being judged. Just be you. Because if somebody's always going to have something to say about it. Who cares? Right. Who cares? No. You know what I'm saying? Because there's somebody out there that's going to fuck with it. 
And somebody out there's going to love it. Somebody out there's mm-hmm. going to take something from it and it's going to help them build it. You know what I'm saying? So we just put it all out there. It's just it's about putting yourself out there if that's what you choose to do and and, and, and see it see it where it goes. Yeah, you know, like you have to be true to yourself and be true to anyone else. And especially when it comes to um, the juggalo family, there's a lot of division. Um, you know what I mean? Like, like gift has been down since been down. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we're actually new to the family. You know what I'm saying? And and I I love what it stands for, what it's about. I see a lot of division. And, and you know, and, and a lot of it is because of that whole judging factor. I feel like you should do this right. a certain way. I feel like you should be like this a certain way when it's really all about individuality and being who you are and the way you want to be. You know what I'm saying? So what what is all of the judgmental shit that's coming in between it and all this division if it was already supposed to be, you know what I mean, being free? You know what I'm saying? So so we are just the, 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 the uh, symbol of that freedom, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, in the midst of all that bullshit, we the freedom, you know? Do you know what you want to do for yourself, fuck everyone else, real shit, because when you got, it boils down to me, especially. I'm a, a messianic dude who granted Christian for the language things, right? If people are not, do you see me sitting there pointing my finger and they don't do the same thing to you? They, they, we embrace each other with love. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, that's it, that's bro. He called right. me and said, yo, where you at? I'm, I'm going away if I can make it there. And vice versa. Man, I was ready to come to West Virginia. Once I'm not going to get into it, but he's ready to come out West Virginia. He's like, all right, let me find a way down. I got you. Baby. And I had to call him back. Hey, I think that was good. You sure? No, I'm going to wear you sure? I'm good, brother. So, yeah. Yeah, and that, that family aspect, you're trying to push the whole family thing where it's like, the family, who you feel is family. That's it. I mean, if you don't agree with somebody, that's fine. They not for you. Everyone's not for everyone. The family ain't always your bloodline. That's true. Mm-hmm. You know, like, we all learned that fast. So, you know what I mean? And I, Found my tribe, yeah. Found my family, you know what I'm saying? So, and that's what we do. We do. <laughs> What's your most useless talents? Um, that's my favorite question, and I'm still not ready. I'm still not ready. To- <laughs> <laughs> he caught me off guard with that shit last time. So so I, I can't do it with an empty bottle, but normally, if a water bottle is full, I can see him for no reason not even looking at it. But I can't think I can do it right now. But it's huge. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.
Sorry. 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 Yeah, but we, you know, we have a joint YouTube, so I, uh, oh, okay. so I, I already jumped in there and did that before the interview. So we, right. that boat's in there. That boat's in there. That's the shit. I appreciate you. So, what would you guys be doing right now if it wasn't for music? I'll probably be working. I ain't gonna lie to you. Now you gonna be a male stripper, man. That's what you are gonna be doing. I already did that. <laughs> I've already been done. It's not for me. I don't make a lot of money. That's what's up. I pretty much be doing, you know, like, because uh, I have a, a lip gloss and lip scrub, and I have a cosmetic line called Mahogany and Royal. It's pretty dope. I'll probably be, you know, doing this, you know, like, 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 you and I probably, I probably would just be like a straight up promoter. Like I still be in the same field. I just, if I wasn't actually making music, I would just be creating a platform for people to perform their music. Because I just, I enjoy putting together. Yeah, that's what I, do my I like bringing people together. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, like the yeah, yeah, we got. For, yeah. Uh, which, uh, which, uh, which, uh, <laughs> it's just music should, should definitely have a spread. Um, in there, you know what I'm saying? We can promote you through that you magazine as well. You feel me? In the entertainment and, and art magazine. So we're we going to tap in with that. Appreciate you. Uh, also an artist, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, yeah. We, we promote artists as well. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't know who, I'm sitting here trying to figure out who's, whose face paint I like the most. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we're trying to have an equal presentation at the group. Who do? Right. <laughs> all clowning and the jokes aside, ironically speaking. Uh, when we paint up as a group versus when we do yeah, individually, we, we try to compliment yeah. one another. Who saw the higher quality? Right. So, so like, so like um, I'm not as bright as this blue. I don't like blue. I like black. So like, I'm not colorful. Right. I'm a, when, so when we yeah. Talk, yeah, I think you're definitely the creepiest one. <laughs> <laughs> you know. I'm yeah. only the creepiest one to put my lines in, and I don't. <laughs> Yeah, bro, you you kind of club. You just I'm just telling you what comes into my head when I'm looking at you. You know what I'm saying? You kind of come off as like, okay, this is the motherfucker to kick it with. He's gonna do a whole bunch of fucking drugs. He's gonna <laughs> he's gonna ride a fucking cow, a fucking bull or some shit. Yeah, like nope. <laughs> I used to be a party boy, man. I did, man. I, listen, full disclosure, I've, I've I've changed a whole lot of things in my life because, I, like I said, my faith is. And help me in that one. That's for me. And I ain't saying it's judging nobody because my faith thinks it means thou shalt not judge. No. Thou shalt not judge. I don't know the scriptures right now. So right. in order to be a real Christian, a true Christian, and walk in faith and walk in love, for me, I, I can't. You know what I'm saying? Somebody be like, oh, how you friends with them? And that, 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 so what? Right. One of my best friends is a Muslim. I'm a Messianic Jew. This is America. You feel what I'm saying? Like, America. America. That's right. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, you know. And I'm such a community myself. I'm from Baltimore City here with me. You know what I mean? I live in West Virginia right now. <laughs> it kind of got me. It's in a little bit. But my whole family come from the farm. That's what one thing people know about me. I'm from the city. I'm the only one. My mama, my grandmama, my, you know, everybody, they all from the farm. Literally. Farmers. So this country shit was in me. It just, it took certain people to be like, no, this, this Right, no, it, it's years. a good look. Like, uh, you guys, you guys are... Killing it with the look, man. Legion, you come off as like this motherfucker or chop your head off and keep it in a jar hidden under his bed. Like, hey, listen, I, I might I might have a couple there already. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, you know, I know I got a graveyard, uh, uh graveyard music too coming soon, but uh, you know what I'm saying? Like for real. And I, I need some I need some features on that. <laughs> you, you feel me? Yeah, you know I, mean? I need some features on that. Uh, All right. I'm talking to every I'm talking to every artist right here. I'm, I need some features on that. Yeah. Speaking of yeah, I owe you one. Speaking of a feature, man, you just killed it with uh, me and uh, man. NGL for life. NGS. Yeah, I didn't know who that song was fire. until that song. Yeah, yeah, you put Why? me on to him because when I when I heard him, I was like, ooh. And then I went and looked him up, and he actually sent me a request. And I looked him up, I'm like, damn. And when I started looking this up, I'm like, oh, he's dope. You know what I'm oh, saying? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I appreciate you for making that connection because that's that that track is fire. Like, that dude, track. dude's young, but he but he's dope. Right. right. So we gonna get a visual on him for that, or <laughs> I don't know, maybe you know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm tighter with you than I am the other dude on the on the song. So, like to make it happen, I think we'd all have to be somewhere. Um, 
I'm probably not going to go to the gathering this year, even if there is one. I'm probably going to go to uh, Tom Woods' float. Okay. So we well, might we be able to make it happen there. Cycle on the way, so we're going to be giving birth around that yeah. time. Yeah, March March 1st is when uh, you're supposed to email them and let them know you want to do it. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of people. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 There was a lot of people last year. Yeah, it's crazy. Like the gathering uh, is the one thing I'm. I had fun from gathering. I've been there so far. One I went to in the last one, of course, the stage was great. But, but like the gathering is supposed to bring more of us together than it does. I mean, I've heard stories that don't match up. There's like, nothing now. You know what I'm saying? Like people like, oh, you think this my new the gathering is supposed to be like, man, that shit don't happen on me. Not from what I've heard. It's crazy. Like last gathering. Literally, we were, we were camped right down the road. A huge fight broke out, like, to our right. We were like, what the fuck? Huh? Like, the security and, and the sheriffs that they allowed us out actually had to get involved. They ain't arrest nobody, not that I know of. So, sorry. I got like, I fake it in and I didn't know. But that's how I misquote them. But, like, even the sheriff was like, ain't y'all supposed to be family? What the fuck? Right. So take this game, because we enjoy y'all. We, you know, we, we not, we're not what you are, but, you know, it's kind of like a moment of vacation on duty for them. You know what I'm saying? And I was just like sitting back listening, like that heavy. Somebody not even part of the culture was like, yo, what are y'all doing? Uh, yeah. What are you here and have a good time together? So what if you hate each other when you're you here? I think it's crazy. You know? And I think that's why there's been rumors about the gathering initially stopping. One, because I see you getting up there and they want to be honest about it. Right? And two, they're not stupid. They sit back and see, they clown around, but they see what the fuck's going on. That, that shit's got to hurt. Like, yeah. other shit. You know, forever ago, and this is what it turned into. That ain't right. And the first big blow, big blow was the FBI shit. You know what I mean? That's why there's a lot of Doug Rose who, you know, I won't say scared, but. I, and that, I think that is a question within the community is should it continue to go on or should it stop before it it's forever tainted? You know, um, something bad happens or something. I'm 39, 39 on that. Half and half. You feel me? Like, I don't know. And the thing is, is people like Tom Woods float, people like Tom you know are starting to do little side things so it, it's it the whole juggalo aspect of it can continue if you remember uh when covid hit and then they didn't have the gathering and then they had the first gathering right mm -hmm. after covid that that gathering was according to everybody i mean i had i wasn't there for a while but according to everybody that gathering reminded everybody of like the old ones you know what I'm saying? The vibe of it. Everybody was cool. Everybody was chill. Nobody was fighting. It was cool as fuck. Next year, it was back to how the gathering's been the past few, you know. I think as being older and growing up in the juggalo culture, the final culture period, like I was eight years old and the older dude stopped me. I had just got to go. I was a little on my block. And the older dude was right there. I don't know who was. I never seen him after that. He was like, hey. He was like, clown? Yes, sir. You okay? Yes, sir. Uh, this is a gang of fake authority. And I was hooked. Clowns and rap. Right. I felt like a clown and outcast anyway, so it worked for me. Oh, but like too. being from coming from that far ago, coming from that long ago, now I think one could possibly save the gathering uh, in, its, in its original intended form, for lack of better verbiage, and make it how it's annual. I say that because you know, we missed the whole year. We went to COVID. Fuck COVID. Um, <laughs> uh, make it. Um, what is it, semi annual, bi annual? When it's, uh, when it's every other year. Make it every other year. Then people really start to appreciate this shit. Like, damn, I remember when we did this every year. Now I remember we did it every two years. Right. It's the idea. I don't know if anybody who has control over that will see yeah, it. But definitely it. shouldn't stop it. It, yeah. it. it definitely shouldn't be something that stopped because, like, that was our first gathering and, and, and it was literally an experience. Not only was it our first gathering, but we got to touch the stage, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and, and do what we love while we were there and, and having that experience. And just to see everybody from all and over come together like that it was like, like for, for clown culture, it was like mind boggling. Like it was crazy. And then I was like, I have to experience this again. And I have to be here again. And I have to do this again. But you know, like it's, it was, it was some stuff that I was saying going on that I, I was like, maybe, maybe we can do without that. But you know what I'm saying? Like, right. if that's what anything though, like, yeah, you know? Yeah. But, um, I, I, you know, if, if our vote counts at all, please keep the gathering. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. I agree. You know, um, 
But even if it does, like I was saying, even if it does end, people like Tom Wood putting on the float, you know, us stuff. doing the mini gatherings we do, us throwing on party. This juggler shit's probably never going to stop, dude. So this is another one of their tracks. This is another classic song. Uh, let's check it out. Is this live? No, it's just a, it's just a song. You get to watch their pretty little faces up there. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. Nigga, you always talking shit. First you want to blow the bank up, now you want to rob. Frank, you want to blow up the bank. Oh, Frank, you want to rob the bank. We get the walk, we get it all, we not gonna charge it. Paint it on in a massive box. Anybody move, you get that pop. You said the bomb, I don't want no cop. I wanna get this quick, I'll be off when the cops come into bars. Now everybody got their roles. Here come the gear, let's go. In and out, let's go. We gotta win this time, it's on. Watch the movie, you'll know. No mistakes, we pros. We don't know why we cycle loads of life, we chose this kind of grown. She take out the armed guards and pop the hit the wind hard. He masked up, so won't nobody know who we are. Like the GCA heist tip, we gotta be quick. Cause if we pull it off, it ain't nobody leaving for shit. <laughs> Everybody loses soon as Legion lights the fuses. Ooh, trust me, fly a strap, no guarantee to give you bruises. Close the door off the vault to hold the stacks out. Who do be a dog and hold this bank tellers back out? Ooh. First, you gon' rob the bank. To my chest, like the fuse and make it break, cause this bitch finna make a mess. So the blue to the green and the yellow to the red. Should I pull a trigger first? I can't remember what he said. Pop the boat and get inside, now I'm excited. Time to bag the racks, I'm on the mission, yeah, I'm plotting. Heard a shot and that's my Q take what you got, it's time to go. If I time to correct you, this bitch should be ready to blow. Wait, what? Why'd you like on fire? Because it's good. It likes being on fire. Does it feel good? Yeah. It's fucking weird. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's forever. It's forever. You know what I'm saying? Right. Clarity shit is forever. But, like, um, and I th I feel like that should be embraced, though. Like you were saying, like, the, you know, having the many gatherings and having people with different organizations just do different things. And, you know what I mean? And have, you know, because we, we wait for the big gathering once a year. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, you know, and and not not everybody can always make it, so it's always not. And everybody live in different places, so it's always nice to just have something going through throughout the year that you know maybe it's something over here, maybe it's something over there, maybe right. like, oh, wait, you know the gathering is coming. You know what I'm saying? Like so, um, you know, we we was actually thinking about doing like a psycho circus gathering. You know what I'm saying? Actually, that's what that's what the psycho circus had actually um, began with. It began with the idea. Of making it like a, a, a type of a mini gathering, yeah. you know, uh, but everybody didn't take little, to the general little, idea. But you know, but yeah, but it's it's something, something. But I'm just saying, like specifically, it's something that's like the circus one. You know, what yeah. I'm saying yeah. as far as the, the circus itself, like yeah. the performing yeah. art circus, we wanted to do that and then bring in, um, you know, different types of performers that do all different types of things and not just you know rappers or singers, but like you know actual circus acts. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? 
turn it into like a juggalo like big top. You know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? Um it was that was like the original like, idea. Like fire fire blows, fire here, so it's yeah. following. Yeah. Well, it's just, it's, it's, it's like taking crazy on, outlandish yeah. it's, it's, it's taking on it's taking on different forms. Mm-hmm. Um we're moving to a street show soon. Um oh. So the, the street show is going to be done. It's going to be a traveling street hip hop show. Delaware. I'm back. That's coming. Yeah, Delaware is coming. We're working on Delaware next. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, New York, we're working on. Um, we got Texas and Florida on the line. Um, and, and of course, the Washington. Northwest, the Pacific Northwest. The, the Oregon and Washington, we love y'all. And we we be back. And we bringing Gifted with us. <laughs> What's up? I mean, um, What's your favorite song I mean, to perform? I really understand, though, with clowns in general. Not every clown is a juggalo. Clowns go right. outside the realm of right. clowns in general don't understand yeah. it. That right. is true. too. Like, not every clown is a juggalo, but every juggalo is a clown, but not every juggalo paints his face like a clown. And that's fine. That's what's different about juggalo culture. You could be a clown and not paint your face. That's fine. Mm-hmm. Other types of clowns, I mean, they kind of like, oh, no, how you clown it. And that's where kind of some of the disconnect comes from. I think. I don't know how to be wrong, but that's just me speaking to personal. Uh, experience, etc. Because I didn't for a few years I couldn't paint my face. I was never there. They were like, yeah, no, you can't do that because that's associated with the drug little gang. The FBI has on list. And I'm just like, <laughs> but I was, you know, I had to say right with that, yes, sir, and keep moving. I was actually arrested some months ago, and uh, I was like, I had to clear some shit up. I went to go get my ID, and I had some shit from ten years ago. They locked me up in D and D, um, and you know, uh, 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 oh, NBA, whatever the fuck they call it. And so I'm riding, and um, the guy, the 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 cop is asking me questions about like my life and shit. So I'm just like talk because I'm not really arrested for anything serious. So he just like having a conversation, and I explained to him that I'm a juggalo. You know what I'm saying? And he's like, "Oh, you 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 guys are like the gang, right? You're like the gang." I'm like, "No, that's not. I don't know. That's not." But it's just crazy because there's law enforcement, like people that are trained to think that we're violent and to think right. that we're we're something negative. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like anybody else, you're not yeah. allowed to go mess with you. Like, leave us alone. We're not bothering anybody. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, okay. I think it's just up to us to, to, to set the record straight. Like, right. so it's it's every juggalo's duty to, to make it apparent that this is love. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, it's it's a, it's a fucking clown given duty. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, so we're on this topic. What, what What's the most trouble you guys have ever gotten into? Mm. I faced ten years for arm, for first degree armed robbery about five years ago. Um, I got it amended to it was my first ever felony. I had been locked up before. It was my first ever felony, and I, I faced ten years. And the clown guards brought me out of that. And you know, I, I only served six months, and they brought it down to a uh, assault. So I got a strike. But yeah, that's the most trouble I've ever had. Me personally. Yeah. What's the most trouble you gotta do? Right? You like you like you've been to the pen a couple times. Believe it or not, no. Say that I'm too bougie for that. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I always got in trouble for fighting. Though. I got locked up for fighting downtown, and I had a razor in my head. Oh, no. and, you know, the girl was bothering me, so you know I took it out of me. And I put it back in my ponytail. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> put it back in my ponytail. And I got in trouble for that because we couldn't find it. I was, uh, I, <laughs> I was under federal investigation for six years. Uh, for doing the Kenneth Hunter and Daniel. I ended up all while being in charge of it several times. That was by the grace of God. But, like, I've lived a life where we've got several agents following me and like, watching everything we do. That was the original one to let go on the city. And I actually had to let one of you know what I was doing because I was walking into the light that I thought was going to initially want to hand me a good idea. I don't want to see you on I had to do my own work. So, but uh, they didn't like that. So, yeah. even though I was still doing stuff that's in the city. Um, so I was doing the job, but I'm not going to get into that. But yeah, I, I walked away from the life, but before I walked away from the life, if anyone in the life, you know what I mean? Um, I got some of the six year investigation. If I did anything, I could get, you know, screaming at somebody, I'm going to prison. You feel me? 
That shit was not fun to listen. So yeah. I do what only what's necessary. Don't take no shit from nobody, but at the same time it's like I had this misconception growing up in the hood and I had to do it. Nah, you know, I don't know that. But I had to miss his ass growing up a little bit, like, that I had to be some kind of you know, badass because I was going to work on my block. So I was always fighting, I always had to prove myself, always to see the fact that I was And it led me without proper guidance into the wrong lifestyle. And then God had to be like, hey, stay here. Shut up, or you're going to go away for a long time. Yes, sir, Jesus. <laughs> you know what I mean? And to make it civil, but that's very seriously, that was the most. Uh, I don't, I don't know if I found this trouble, but I mean, had I not listened, I, I wouldn't have been like that. They had me locked away in the box. You know? Yeah. I appreciate you guys getting on this just music, man. We only got a few minutes left, and I got to get a drop out of you. So I think we're going to uh, go ahead and end it right now. You know what I mean? But go ahead and let them know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? What do you guys got coming up next? What's going on with you guys? Uh, we got the uh, um, take two. So we missed the UV show. Psycho Circus was supposed to open for UBI of uh, Zestru um, on January 20th in Tacoma. That didn't happen. So we so we just, yeah, we missed the flight. <laughs> and then so um, we decided to run it back and we're going to be the live stream show for everybody to see uh, March 3rd. Uh, it's, it's called Take Two. Um, we get, get the 39s coming through. We got Yachty Six. We got the one four three music band. We got Cool Green. We all got a new song coming. The Children of the Circus. We'll be doing that first performance ever. Our children will be on the stage for the first time ever. You know, what I'm saying in, in, in a live event. Um, and that's going to be 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, and you can buy your tickets straight through Facebook. It's going to be on Facebook Live. Watch from your phone, your TV, your computer, your laptop, your best friend's house. It's only eight bucks. It's about to be fucking fire. And and uh, yeah, that's that's what we got going on in March. Um, then we got April coming up. We got the Clown Show coming. So we got a bunch of different artists from all over the city that's coming through to show their version of a clown. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> and you know, and shortly after that, the, the first Psycholos mixtape. Mm -hmm. We we we. That's all we're gonna say about that one, though. <laughs> we're not gonna give you too much on that one because that's we. Yeah, yeah. You see that? That's the, the emoji. The emoji. <laughs> <laughs> and also, uh, I'm, I'm, in, I'm in negotiations with a, a vendor, uh, he's the owner of a bar in Delaware, mm -hmm. town where my family is. I'm not going to reveal the town yet, but um, I'm getting everything solidified on they have a return of new thing on production presenting type of service on the shore. Yeah. Right on the Delaware Maryland line. So, yeah, Bo LB Sick Man, Bo LB Sick Man. Yeah, I appreciate Bo you, Sick man. Bo, right, Bo, Bo. Bo. Well, yeah, vote for real. Vote or the car was going to I mean, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Well, they got me votes now. All right. I need a drop. Make it really cool because you guys look cool, so make it like. <laughs> All right. So so we got we got to do it with. We got to do it. All right. So you got to do. You got to. You got to be like. I don't know. We got to like. Say different words or something. Wait, make it cool. I mean, it's just me. It's me. You know, or we are the psychologists. So yeah, how, how do you guys want to? We're the psych. We're the psychologists. You're watching. It's just music with Sick Ent on the Signature Series Network. So okay. somebody introduce you guys, and somebody say the next part, and then on the I'll Signature Series I'll Network. We are the psychologists. We watch. It's just music with Sick Ent. And, and where is it? What's the last one? On the Signature Series Network. On the Signature Series Network. Yeah. On the Signature Series. Okay. So, right. you ready? Yeah. Go. We're the Cyclone. You're watching It's Just Music with Sicko ENT. On the Signature Series Network. Whoa, whoa. 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 Yeah. That's dope. All right, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> All right, bro. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Hey, we did, man. Thank you so much. We appreciate you having us. How long? Uh, ain't no rest, but how long? Uh, Roughly, will it be before it's ready and all that stuff? I don't know. Fuck it. Who knows? Um, <laughs> do, you, do you need some? Do you need like a song from us or something? Yeah, we need right. three to five. Three to five? Yeah. <laughs> we don't have that many just we yet. Have, well, we got uh, like two or three. You got yeah. something? We'll make some work. We'll get yeah. it to you. Uh, Word. Yeah, so Dude, you look crazy. You look more crazy without the fucking <laughs> hat on and glasses. Yeah, I had to dumb it down a little bit though. <laughs> 
I'm going to have nightmares after this interview. Take a picture. Take a picture. That's that's a good uh, thumbnail right there. Hell yeah. yeah. All right, man. All right, now. So I'm about to show a whole bunch of videos of them at the gathering in, I think it was 2021. It might have been last year. You enjoying yourself? Yeah. Check her out on Crazy Diane Reacts. Look that up on YouTube. She's got a pretty cool review show. We record once in a while. We just did an Esham song. It's pretty cool. Are you and your cat? Yeah, my cat's outside. Let's get let's get into these. So about two or three years ago, uh, Get to 39 got a hold of me and asked me to be a part of a song. I don't think I've ever played this song on the show. This is a classic. To me, it's a classic. Uh, it's funny, you know what I mean? It's very male chauvinistic, if you will. It's called Hornography. Check it out. Oh, you want to see it? Oh, okay. Come here. <laughs> Pornography. I don't need it because I can do photography. A cinematography of any female riding me. Why? Because I'm a G. I don't lie, but I tell her what I am in need. Usually this ain't a war, she's slobbing me. If I can get those two, I don't need the V. You and me, they don't need the C. We gon' do what we came for, please believe. And I came to come more, so come release. There's some of the fluid that's backed up in my jeans. Some of my testes, so please test these with green. I don't need the weed, I'm high on all of your feet. They say that I'm mean, but baby, nothing is free. Basically, F you, pay me green. I got bills, you just a chick that laid with G. But you must have liked this dick. Cause you paid the king Now I pull down my zipper Suck on my ding a -ling. I used to wonder how people Could write and sing these things Now I've become the freak I couldn't believe But I'd rather be the way For when I need a release Chick one, two, three That's the first day of the week Call me an HOE But I don't know what you mean Bitch, I'll take it to your face I'm sexually free Now spin around Bend over and give it to me yeah. There's a reason that they call me sick She rides a dick And I choke her Provoke her Do nasty shit I spin her upside down She sucks the dick I lick the clip I must admit a perfect fit, body fluids transmit She say it's the first time she wanna try and I look her in the eyes, I can tell she told the fable This is daddy's little freak, smack her on the butt cheek Listen to the bed squeak, an ancient great technique Why must she lie, I'm trying to have a good time Don't be feeling all embarrassed, put up your feet, I'm the rarest I'm a freak, I'll use a character, feeling incoherent Playboy, convoy, full of sexy chicks And they all lined up just the right this dick I come quick, no shit Cause the chick might fall in love And I don't have no conscience So I'm using no glove And if a baby pop up Sure I'll be your baby daddy But you ain't coming around No, you don't make me happy Full custody, trust me It's better this way You fucked on the first day And that screaming may day Cause let's face it man Most girls today ain't shit Quick to quick the family Just the right Don't some dick I get high No lie, no such thing as love L-O-V-E-E-V-O-L Bitch suck my dick Go burn in hell LB sickening A Yours? What? 
What picture did you show? Yeah, uh, it was. It was the spread for it's just music. It's just music, the dopest fucking podcast on the internet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. LB Sickney make another video for my sickos. I appreciate you. Shout out to Ninth Wonder Magazine. Shout out to Psycho Circus. Shout out to the Legion of God and the motherfucking Gifted 39 and anybody else that looks like you. Thanks for being on the show. You're welcome. With all this time we put in. Hey, Chris Ballou from the Presidents of the United States of America. Yo, what's happening, y'all? This is Wishbone. Both of us are working for the army. Yo, what up? It's Jerry Robinson from the Strange Music. I'm Bad Bad Ponder. Yo, what up, Camp Folk? This is your boy Smoke. Woo, woo, raise a ray here in the face. You're watching, it's just music. What's up, what up, world? It's your boy Chill Willie the Billy Man. Y'all already know what's going on. A whole lot. Dang, shit going on on my side, you feel me? Yo, this is Gum Gear with Lyrical Snuff Productions out of Denver, Colorado. Yo, what's happening? This Pokemon Project Born, and it's just music, and you rockin' with Sicko ENT. What up? It's Cody Manson, repping LS2, Firefly, and Man, this is A.O. Dre, and you are watching Just Music. I'm Jason Dawes from Double Dare Entertainment, and you're watching It's Just Music. Your boy Cognito, you watching It's Just Music. Uh, LB, Sickening Sicko Entertainment. What's up? This is Frank Nitty from Project Born. And it's just music. The boy Chuckles, the head kind of clown hair. Yeah, what up, Chuckles? My boy, LB, sick And it's just music.